the start positions of these finalists. So please welcome Nina from Serbia! Congratulations and questions so we can give the time to the press people. Thank you very much. So let's start with Serbia. Congratulations again. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Now it's your turn, members of press. First, national press. Is there any question? Are you from national press? Yes? Here, please. Just wait for the microphone. It's coming to you. Please introduce yourself, tell us where you're from, which you media organization for it. Uh, Nina, congratulations. Thank you. We are all very proud. Uh, just to mention that uh, 50 years after the first Serbian singer, Ljena Petrovic, entered the uh, Eurovision and started our tradition on this competition, you entered the final. Uh, you are educated for making magic, for making chemistry. Would you save the same formula for the finals, or will you put some new substances to make it bigger and bigger? And first, first, uh, first regards and first uh, congratulations uh, are coming from Sombor. This is over there is one big Hvala, thing. Hvala. Thank you, fingers for you. Okay. Is it on? Yeah. Uh, thank you so much first and of course uh, I did this magic because I had a wonderful people around me and of course my people in Serbia uh, who support me a lot and thank you so much for that thank you Europe and uh, respect magic I'll probably <laughs> even do better uh, I mean I hope that I'll do better and my girls that we're all gonna be magical as we were in the first semi-finals. So, thank you so much. Thank you. So, now it's open for international press to ask a question. Yes, please, here. Hello. Just wait for the microphone. <laughs> Roy Bennett from ASCtoday.com. Magical, magical performance. <clears throat> While you were waiting for the results, it really applies to all of you, but could you feel your heartbeat? <laughs> yes, of course. It was, it, was, it was an amazing feeling, I can tell. You know, we were excited and scared. 
scared a little bit, but you know, it's an amazing feeling. And when they said that we we were like first to uh, like get it out, so it was it was great. It was great. Thank you. Now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for our lucky fairy. Good lucky fairy. Big applause for her. Hello. Good evening. How are you? Fine. So now, please pick the magic bubble, and we'll know your starting position for the big night. And show the number camera. Position 24. 24. So we can now see this on our boards and uh, to remember you. In 2008, Russia wins with this start position. Okay, now it's your turn, Evelina. So, now we have the national press that can ask questions to Lithuania. And there's a flag here, so just hold on, the microphone is coming right to you. Congratulations, Evelina, it was so amazing. What can you tell for all the people who not expected to see you in the final? The only thing I can tell you to tell them is this is what you got. How do you feel now? Amazing. I just feel amazing. This is what I wanted. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. So now a question from international press. Please stand up. <laughs> okay, you are international. Ask. <laughs> Please wait for the mic. Yes, here. Right, right block, here. second row. Thank you. It's very nice to say a little bit something in Polish. Congratulations. Uh, your voice was great. What was your first fall when enveloped with the name of the country was strong? Uh, I think that it is shocking. The, f the first time I got just to jump high to the sky and I still can't believe what happened. I hope that in about an hour or two I will already realize where I am and what I am doing. Thank you very much. Evelina, now it's your turn to pick your lucky number. The good luck fairy is coming up to you. Choose your number. Radio. Um, guys, can you describe your feelings on reaching the final? 
and maybe share with us also a few words of your feelings in Greek for our Greek program back home. Uh, at first, we would like to congratulate all the 10 countries that qualified on the final. And you know, uh, our song is a song uh, we pass through the soul. So, I can answer for me and stir my grip. I think that, you know, I gave all my soul at the time. And for the next 30 minutes I was empty. This is the aim and the purpose of our song. Because the message is to, uh, if we have the fire in our soul, to burn the fears and as many times we fall down, we can stand up again and survive. So, through this message I, I gave my soul and that well, was all I can do. So, thank you so much. Bye. There's not much to add to that, but maybe I'll give you the Greek side of it for once. But it's wrong. Um, yeah, it's not bad for me. I had the stakes here from the ladder of all of the Cosmo. I think it's all of the Cosmo. And I thank you for understanding the soul that we wanted to give with this song. Thank you. So, one more question. Okay, let's welcome our lucky fair, good lucky fair, Hilda. So, please pick your start number for the big evening. And your start position on Saturday will be... You can see it first. See it as nine or as six, but we prefer nine. <laughs> we prefer this one like a number. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's nine. nine. It's nine. <laughs> so thank you so much. Okay, you can see it on our board. The ninth performance is from Chris. We have more spots to fill. Elder Aniga, congratulations first of all. questions do we have one question over here please stand up so we the microphone's right next to you go ahead hello please. from Azerbaijan firstly congrats and thank you a lot for taking us in the final thank and you. the question is how do you feel about the country that didn't get into final and what do you wish to that countries they didn't get to the final yeah um, I would say that they were uh, all of the countries that took part in the first semi-final were very, very strong. And, and it's the greatest pleasure and the biggest honor for us to be on the same semi-final with them. I wish them, all of them, good luck. And we will really, really miss them. Yeah, but I think that our friendship doesn't stop right now. You know, it's, it's getting nearly to fabulousness and it continues, of course. Thank you. <laughs> Do we have more quite another question from international press? Okay, you're holding up your hand real high, so go ahead. Here, here in front, the second row. Second row. Hi, Roy again from ESCToday.com. Oh. Um, Hi. Oh, that was a little far back, but you seemed very nervous on the stage when you started. Did anything happen to make you nervous tonight? No. For me. Phone call for anyone? <laughs> I was so excited today, to be honest, but... Did you have contact with your family beforehand? Yes. Did that make the you nervous? The thing is, uh, my daughters, they were watching me step by step from London, and uh, today they came to support me, and uh, for me it was so important not to fail, because I dedicated to my kids. Now it's your turn to pick your start position. The good luck fairy is coming right up to you, behind you. 
first national media, please? And there must be national media here, so Switzerland is not so far away. Do we have national media here? God, there's no questions. <laughs> Go ahead, please. Hold on, the microphone is coming. Just okay. You're coming to the microphone. <laughs> coming to the microphone. Hi, Anna. Hi. Uh, Armin from Hamburg. Uh, congratulations. Thank you so much. For a wonderful, charming performance on stage. Um, what I want to know is um, actually. What were your last feelings or thoughts before going on stage? Was it okay or just, well? I was nervous. very nervous, of course. Um, yeah, it's, I'm always nervous when I go on stage, and um, yeah, it's so cool that we are in the final. <laughs> and um, thank you so much that you vote for me. Thank you so much. Um, but that's really, it's really hard to say what I'm, what the feelings are when I'm going on stage. But I can't. It's, I can't imagine that I'm final. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> okay, so next is international media. There's someone who <laughs> is really trying to ask you a question. Go ahead. Hi there. Uh, my name is Sunny Spells. I'm originally from television, but now I live in Australia. And I'm reporting for radio station 4 Triple Z in Brisbane, the queer radio show. Anna, congratulations. Thank you. Out of all the songs, and I don't want to make this against anyone. What's your question, please? So surprised to see you there. Anna, are you Switzerland's next Celine Dion? <laughs> Merci beaucoup. Okay, thank you. And now it's your turn to pick your lucky number. My hands are so yeah, but it's not easy to open the magic bubble. one is Katie from Hungary. Hello. So now question please first national media. Who wants to ask a question? Please introduce yourself. Hello, my name is Panka Bajko from Blik. Uh, first of all I just want to say something in Hungarian. Nagyon 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 biscuit vagyunk rá, és gratulálunk neked. Uh, just we are very proud of you, and I just uh, want to ask, uh, what did you realize about uh, it, what happened in the arena when you started your song? Well, did you see the people standing up and, cry, uh, and shouting? Did you realize anything? Yes. <laughs> when I went to a stage, I heard uh, a magic voice from the audience, and I would. I'd like to thank them because it depends on them that I am here, and it was amazing. Of course, it's it's amazing to a singer. How old are you now? Now, uh, I, I think that I, I am dreaming now. Dreaming <laughs> is good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Next question, please. Yes, please. Here in the middle. Uh, hello, I'm from ESCDaily.com. Uh, what what's your name? Sorry, you? could you could you tell us what's your name? Ermin, Ermin, thank you. From ESCDaily.com. Uh, what message do you have for your fans and supporters, and where are you partying tonight? <laughs> my message, thank you. And do it again on Saturday. This is my message to the audience. <laughs> and I don't know where I'm going. Uh, I, I only know where I have, when I have to sing and where, and that's what I Organized, nothing else is organized than me, but okay, thank you. Now, our lucky fairy is coming with magic bubbles for your starting position on Saturday. So, Okay. Now, 
guys, Oscar from Finland. National media can ask a question. Please get stand up. So, yeah, thank you. Perona, it's Oscar. I'm Juha Veliokinen from Finnish Evening Newspaper. You are the youngest one among those great European artists. What is your message to Europe, and how did you feel on stage? What did you learn about show business tonight, Oscar? Poor student from Helsinki, fresh man. Tell us. Wow, that was one very complicated question. Um, I will make the answer very simple. Um, what I want to say to people, I'm, I'm uh, very grateful that uh, people voted me to be in the final, and I'm also very grateful that so many other very good ones uh, were chosen, and I think that Europe's heart is in the right place because there was so much, so much votes for, for good music. And, um, so it's uh, that question was really complicated. It's difficult to give a simple answer, but you probably asked something about how I feel, and I feel great, of course. <laughs> and uh, it's a great honor, and uh, it's great to be here. It's so young, and uh, yeah, I, I hope you got the answer to one of those questions. I think that was the essence of the question. How do you feel? You answered it. <laughs> So, next is international media. Do we have questions here from international media? If you have one, please stand up so it's easier for me to see you. Over here, please. Okay, it's uh, Martijn van der Veen, uh, Eurovision artist in the Netherlands. I was wondering, now that you are in the final, uh, winning might be a possibility. Does that scare you or makes you more anxious? Um, so far, this hasn't been a competition for me. It's just been a great honor and a, a great uh, place to, to perform my music and get people to, to listen to the music that I write. And I don't think it's going to be a competition from now on either. So, so it's going to be just me having fun and me playing music for people singing and having fun so I mean of course there's a possibility to win and that's a great honor too but it doesn't uh, it's so far ahead that I can't think of it yet sorry okay. now it's your turn to pick your start position uh, good luck fairies behind you Next morning, uh, <laughs> really, uh, and uh, <laughs> you know, I, I don't know. Of course, uh, my dog was first who congratulated me because uh, I have uh, this. Uh, my friends gave me this. Uh, this I don't know how to call. Me, it's Mini Elvis. My, my, the name of my of my dog is Elvis. I'm sorry, I'm really nervous right now because oh, it was not easy to. Uh, to wait when they tell that Russia is gonna go to final, and uh, I'm I'm uh, really it, it's not answer of your question. I just wanna uh, thank uh, everybody that uh, 
I am here, and uh, also I want to say one thing because uh, a lot of very, very good artists not here with us right now after this semi-final. And I want to, you know, uh, hear your applause for them. Really. Thank you. Welcome. So, we have the next question up here. Hi, uh, Thorsten Keller, um, uh, Kölner Stadtanzeige, daily newspaper from Germany. Um, hello. Hello. I think it's going to be a great party tomorrow night, the Russian party. Uh, yes, Russian party. Uh, but it was scheduled before the semi final. Uh, ah. So, it could have been a sad party tomorrow night. So, what made you so confident that it's going to be a great party and something to celebrate tomorrow? You know, uh, it was not easy to uh, do party after semi final because I I didn't know what what gonna be in this in, in this night. So uh, I'm really I'm, now I'm very happy that this party tomorrow because uh, everybody. Of course, I I wait for everybody tomorrow in uh, Euro Club to have fun. Really, you should come tomorrow <laughs> because it will be very funny. Yeah. Thank you. These nice guys with guitar will be there. And we'll and we will sing. <laughs> we will sing something for you. And uh, I, I, you know, I, I can't answer for your question. Uh, I, you know, uh, sometimes uh, everybody should uh, have some dream or hope. And you know, uh, the all my life, uh, be here on Eurovision Song Contest was my dream. And now I'm here. I'm very happy. And uh, I also have had dream that uh, I will in, in final and this party tomorrow will be a really party. It's not, you know, like, okay, goodbye, uh, thank you for, <laughs> for everything. <laughs> so I'm very happy. And I wait for you tomorrow. Thank you! Alexei, yes? now it's time to pick your lucky number for the big night. So choose a magic bubble. Thank you. So we can see it now on our boards. And last but not least, we have Sionese friends from Iceland in the corner. And congratulations to you, first of all. Thank you. Do we have any national media from Iceland here? Over here, please. The man who is standing behind you. A uh, big fan of commentator for Ruru for Iceland. To hear me, you know what? To hear me, you show me friends. To hear me, you show me. We came here all the time. Yay! And uh, that means we're so glad we're coming through. Um, this is the third year in a row Iceland is picked tenth out of the hat. They torture us, this tiny country in the north. Um, we felt our heart beat. How was it for you? If it was a very strange feeling because there were so many talented artists tonight and so many countries that could have been in the final and should and it's just uh, we were just cheering life and enjoying ourselves and uh, so we threw ourselves on top of each other when we sorry we about spilling the wine yeah. the white carpet there are lots of tears in the commentary box I tell you happy was on the floor yeah there were a lot of tears with us as well this is of course uh, very emotional for us, but we're very happy to get to the finals and do it for Shani. Yeah. Well done. Thank you. And now we open this up to international media over here. Please, please stand up. Yes, uh, Martin Kramer from uh, Antenne Ungarn German Radio. You know, the last envelope is always very cruel. Cool. But in this special situation, when Turkey is still in, who always qualified, Armenia is still in, and Norway, honestly, did you really have any hope that the name Iceland will get in the last envelope? No. No, 
Now, we, we hope that um, our song will touch the hearts of people because uh, it is so important to us, the message in our song is so important to just tell people that life can be really short and we have to live life today and not wait to do the things we want to do until tomorrow because we don't know how much time we'll have with our loved ones. So for us, we had the hope, but there were so many strong countries in there, so we were just cheering. <laughs> Thanks for that message, and now it's your turn to pick your start position. first 10 start positions filled from the first 10 finalists. There are 10 remaining spots on our board. We will pick them after the next semi-final, which is in two days. Thank you for everyone to be here. I hope we see you in two days again. And now we will ask the delegation to move on.